It was around late July, 1999, in the Sutton Courtney gravel pits, just outside my hometown of Didcot, Oxfordshire, when spotted a large black cat. I was on my way to a lake, which was one of my regular fishing spots, it was a typical calm summer's evening, around 7 o'clock. Driving down a gravel track, at about 20 mph, due to multiple speed ramps, then, striding out of some tall grass, at the track side, some 50 feet away, came a large black cat, which stepped onto the track. Not thinking, I accelerated towards it, and stopped 2 to 3 meters away. I jumped out of the car, now being more cautious, not wanting to get any closer, I stood on the door sill. I looked over the car and watched as the cat rounded a fence post, and made its way back into the tall grass, and vanished as quickly as it had appeared. The cat was about 5 or 6 feet long with a long tail nearly as long as its body and about 3 feet in height, it was very short for its size but very muscular with big padded paws. And black all over, my best guess is that I was either a puma or jaguar. With big padded paws. And black all over. It continued to walk back into the grass, upon where getting 5 meters away from me it seemed to duck and disappeared from my view. I never told anyone about this because I thought nobody else would believe me. Nehemiah's close encounter is the latest in a long line of supposed big cat sightings in Oxfordshire. In August, West Oxfordshire dog walker Fraser Downer thought he spotted a panther-like creature on Stonesfield Common near Charlberry. Oxford resident Steve Archibald, who runs the website BigCatSightings.com believes there are definitely breeding populations of big cats in the UK, if not in Oxfordshire. This picture, which hangs on the wall at the Mason's Arms pub in Briais Norton, shows the oft-sighted beast of Burford supposedly creeping through a nearby field.